Somalia's defense minister, Abdi Osman Madadi, who is attending the African Union summit at Speak Resort Munyonyo, says more peacekeeping troops should be sent to protect his fragile government holed up in Mogadishu. The message is African Union to be together, to support Somalia, to send immediate you know, peacekeeping force uh, with huge number, so to eradicate you know, these enemies. Earlier he had said the recent attacks in Kampala demonstrated how far the Al-Shabaab had extended its terrorist frontiers beyond its home turf. Underlining the Horn of Africa as an enclave of Islamic militancy, Osman said the Al-Shabaab had recruited a force of 3,000 with some fighters coming from as far as Afghanistan and Yemen. We have got uh, numbers of foreigners, many numbers, more than even 3,000 of foreigners. This is, you know, what you make, made, you know, Al-Shabaab, you know, to be strong. During today's meeting, the foreign ministers of Japan and German pledged to train Somali troops to restore sanity in a country that has been plunged by anarchy for over two decades. This program of training Somalia, is, Somali institutions, particularly the army and the police, has been going on. But I think we now we think we need to scale it up because of this threat. These Al-Shabaab actually must be removed from. As the Al-Shabaab spreads its tentacles beyond its home turf across the East African region, the African Union meeting taking place right here at Munyonyo presents yet the best opportunity to rally African states to root out the Al-Qaeda disciples. Emma Mtaizibwa, NTV Tonight.